Hi everyone, welcome. This is a house tour video. I just got this new place for myself and for Market Up, which is my marketing agency. Let me show you around. This is in Bangalore near the airport. I really wanted to find a place where I can juggle between the center of the city and the airport. I keep traveling all the time. Tomorrow I'm flying to Mumbai for a very special launch of my book. Stay tuned for that. But this is what the space looks like. I'll give you a whole tour of this place. This is the main hall. As you can see, all of the furniture that you're seeing is purchased from IKEA. Yes, that infamous 80,000 rupees IKEA post that you might have seen on Twitter. And this is what we got as a result of it, right? So we have this main place. I wanted it to be minimal, right? That's why I got this coffee table. I have some scented flowers over here. We have this uh, IKEA sofa. I got this very nice chair. So basically, the best part about this chair is that I can just lay down and I will fall asleep on this chair in the next 15 minutes. That's the best part about it. But yeah, this is a coffee mug that was sent to me by Saheli. Oh my God, oh, oops. By Saheli, thank you so much Saheli for that. Nice, cute gift. What else do we have? This is a 50 inch OnePlus TV. We don't really watch a lot of TV, but sometimes whenever we are chilling, we would like to just watch some movie or something. So we have that going on, little Netflix and chill. This right here is the balcony. Uh, by the way, this is the wallpaper that we got. We got it done custom made. It looks very good. And yeah, moving on to the balcony, this is what the space looks like. It's very spacious and especially in the evening, this place looks amazing, right? I'll put some videos and photos over here so that you can have a look at that. This is the place where we hang all of our clothes. I am learning to wash clothes, to clean the house, all of those things when you do when you don't have parents around you. I am learning to do that. So this is where I hang my clothes to dry. So that's the balcony. This is the main place. This is the workstation that we recently purchased again from Ikea for people who will be working with us. So by the way, here is where Kushal who's shooting the video was sitting and we'll get one more person who sits over here and will be working, right? By the way, I am looking to hire people. So if you are into maybe videography or if you are into sales, then let me know, reach out to me on this email. Moving on, this is just a very simple fridge, Samsung fridge, nothing interesting to see inside. This is the most unorganized part of the house which is the kitchen. As you can see, we have a ton of this uh, cardboard boxes that I have to throw away. I will do that. But uh, we have this microwave, we have a stove, we have some water, and that's all that we have. We also have some protein. This one is Muscle Blaze, not sponsored. That's all, that's all that we have. We love making milkshakes, right? So me and my co-founder Saranj, every day, whenever we would be done with the gym, we would come back, we would put some milk, we would put some uh, peanut butter, some whey powder, and we would just put some dry fruits and we would make a very thick milkshake and have it after a good gym session. All right, moving on, let's keep going. This is the hallway. We got this from Ikea as well, very nice looking light. Let's enter Saranj's room, he's not in the house, so let's enter his premises. Darte, kya? This is what his uh, setup looks like. He got this very nice chair from Green Soul. Again, not sponsored, oops. He to gir gaya. So this is his setup, we got this table second hand and we got this uh, monitor from amazon he has this very nice alarm clock which he never really uses this is a life plan that we got from neon which is one of our clients thank you so much for that this is just a standard bed that we got from ikea again that right there is a van gogh painting and that's about it the best part about this place you know is this view that you can see this is the best part about this whole room it's very lively and the light is always there so it feels very good all right moving on these are some almiras to keep our clothes moving on let's go and have a look at my room so this right here is my room with the standing desk that you would have seen in the previous house tour video we have this mokobara bag that i've been using for all of my travels i recently traveled to dubai as well as to singapore so use this it's very handy and easy to use and looks very aesthetic as well what else do we have i have this uh, bed that i got from neil kamal got this pocket spring mattress from ikea finally investing into a good mattress and uh, what is that pillow one more thing that i have is this eye mask it's one of the most underrated purchases that you can do it's just like 100 rupees but you can just keep it and you can sleep for longer normally by eight o'clock 
the light from the windows start coming into my room and I'm still sleeping at that time. And that's why I use this. Moving on, what else do we have? This is what my workstation looks like. I have my laptop. This is the MacBook Pro 14 inches. We have this power bank, huge, huge saver, right? I got this from Xiaomi 20,000 mAh. It works very well. And along that, I also have this uh, Belkin braided uh, lightning C lightning connector. It's very important to use the braided ones because normal kya hota hai? Whenever you're using the iPhone ke jo milte hai, Apple se jo cable hote hai, it breaks very easily. So you need to have a braided one. Moving on, I have this Keychron setup. I think you've already seen this in previous videos. I have the Logitech MX Master 3 mouse. I have this very handy gadget organizer. So basically this opens up into this. As you can see, I can keep my SD cards. I can keep some more storage over here. I can keep all of my adapters inside. And after that, I have some wires over here. I have some SSDs over here. And that is all that we have. Again, I got this from Amazon. I'll put all of the links of the things that you are seeing over here in the description so that you can have a look at that if you want to. This is the standard 29 inches LG ultra wide monitor as well. And that's all that we have to show you. This standing desk I got from uh, Green Soul for about, I think, 27,000 rupees. Best investment that I've made. If you are working for hours on your desk, you need to get yourself this standing desk because you'll just be sitting, right? And sitting is the new cancer, right? So that's why I got this. It's very useful. Moving on, I have this Almira. It's very unorganized, so I'm sorry about that. We have some uh, simple perfumes. I got this very nice perfume from Myopi. What is it called? Oops. So I got this, this is Venom and Pablo. Very nice scent. I apply it whenever I'm going for parties and dates. Moving on, what do we have? I have a sunscreen, again, very underrated thing. I think more people should be applying sunscreen whenever they go outside or even in-house. Helps you out with your skin. Moving on, that's pretty much it that we have here. I have my bag that I use whenever I'm traveling. I have started traveling light. So what that means is that I will use this small suit. Even if I'm going for a seven day trip, I try to pack everything in this one bag itself. That includes my two shoes, that includes all of my uh, chinos, my jeans, my t-shirts, my shirts, and my undergarments as well. So that's what we have going on. I have this chocolate from Dubai that I got from the duty-free airport. Let's see, I have some uh, shoes that you can see. I got both of these from Dubai, very economical. And then I got this AF1 Pandas from uh, Dubai as well. So this one cost me a pretty penny right there. This is the most unorganized part. I don't want to show you this. Let's, let's just close it right there. But that's all that we have. This is just the washroom. Nothing interesting to see over here. Let's just close that. Okay, what else? What else do we have? Let me show you the most interesting part of this house, which is going to be this place that I have been trying to make for the last one month. This is the podcast shooting area. I have been doing a ton of podcasts on my channel if you've been watching my videos. And this is what this place looks like. It's super unorganized right now. I have a lot to do over here. But first of all, we have these studio lights, Godox SL60Ws. As you can see, we have two of these over here to light up the whole scene. I have these two camera stands. One of the camera is over there and the other is shooting this video. I purchased really nice quality podcast, you know, mics. This costed me about 45,000 for both of them. And then I got these 5,000 rupees chairs from, uh, not from Ikea, from Amazon. And all of this, I, I got this very interesting bulb from uh, Singapore airport, the Changi airport. And the best part about this is that the filament is made in the world of dream, as you can see, right? Ma, will you show me something? Ma? Chalo, bhai. Dekho, ab main kya karta. Ma, will you show me something? One more cute thing is this Harry Potter Lego that I purchased from the Universal Studios in Singapore. I got this from the Lego shop that is near the, the Universal uh, Studios area. What else do we have? I got all of these things from uh, Amazon and Ikea. This 
is my book which is coming out tomorrow super excited about that go check it out on amazon and buy it if you have not already pre-orders has already started unicorn secret the story of 20 unicorn founders compressed into about 200 pages you'll get to learn a lot from their journeys then of course we have my first og book that i published in 2019 this is crush it on linkedin just a simple guide about how can you start creating content on linkedin and build your personal brand so that you can get opportunities so i got this as well we bought this very nice buddha statue from uh, pure home living uh, so this is very good what else do we have oh i also got this this uh, cute pikachu from uh, a japanese place called don don donkey which is in singapore as well so this was very good what else i got this light again from ikea it's called iskarna then what do we have i have some more pieces over here i have this fake plant all of these plants are fake by the way if you did not catch that already then i got this nice hourglass. glass hourglass. glass we got this very nice hourglass glass over here i have this bits pilani souvenir that i got i did not graduate but they still gifted me this so thank you so much bits pilani goa campus for this i got this gift from tane pratap sir if you have not seen my videos with Tanya Pratap, you should definitely watch it. You'll get to learn a lot if you are a software developer. So that's a hulk right there. I have a ton of books over there, as you can see. Let me turn this around. So the worst part about this place is that it's congested, as you can see, right? There's too much stuff over here. I have a couple of paintings from my visit to Banasthali Vidya Peet. Thank you so much to all the people over there who created these uh, drawings of me, sketches of me. I have some more books over here. I have this one memory from Ramoji Film City. Last year, May, I went there and had a blast with my friend Yash Garg, as you can see. So that's a good memory that I keep to myself. That's it. That's the place. Again, we have this, this uh, very spacious window that you can see right here. I have to cover it for the most part because I will be shooting podcasts over here. So that's about it. We also have some more space to keep things. One more interesting thing that I got from Ansh Mehra is this Harry Potter wand that you can see right here. He got it from London for me. So thank you so much for that. Essentially, it's a pen that you can uh, use to write with and you can also turn on the light from the other end of this pen. So there is that. What else do we have? I got some stickers from my Google I.O. visit. Thank you so much to Google for inviting me for the I.O. event in Bangalore. It was a amazing experience. This is the photo from the Google I.O. event itself. That was interesting. Then again, we have some storage place over here. What else? I have this package to keep all of my cameras and lenses into. What else? Then we have some more space to keep some equipment. Right. So as you can see, these are all the stands that I have that I use whenever I have multiple camera setups. And then what else do we have? Yeah, this is a bit more unorganized. As you can see, all of the packages that I use. So there you have it. Then that's pretty much it. That's all that we have in this room. I've shown you all of the three rooms. I've also shown you the hall and the kitchen. Now let's go over and take a look at outside of this house because the reason to get this place was number one, this house and also what we have around this place. So let me show you that. And if you're enjoying this video so far, make sure that you hit the like button and let's go and have a look at that. Also, let me know in the comment section if you can tell what this place is, what this area is in Bangalore. And that's going to be a fun exercise for all of you. All right, let's keep going. So the best part about this place is the top floor, which is 33rd floor and all of the amenities of this apartment is at the top floor itself. So we'll just go there and have a look at what all do they have at the top floor itself. Another great view from uh, my floor. As you can see, there is an IIT park over there. There is a Leela hotel over there. There is a mall over there as well. And a lot of construction noises all the time. That's the problem why I'm not able to shoot videos in the daytime. But uh, anyways, let's go up. By the way, Guess the rent that I'm paying to stay over here in this 3 BHK. Let me know in the comment section as well. So we tried our best. We took two days and we found this place and we finalized it. There is no point of spending a ton of time searching for a house. We just want a place which would be near to the airport as well as the center of the city as well. And that's what we got over here. It's about 30 minutes. 30 minutes from the airport itself. We are at the top floor. Let's go. So here you have the place 
if you want to order some groceries or if you want to get some food. The first thing that you have on the top floor of this whole apartment is this place right here. This is where you can get some breads, you can get some unhealthy food as well if you want to. Begar hai bhaiya, main to toot gaya. And let's move on. We can get shakes, starters, sandwiches and burgers. But let's keep moving to the next place. This is the Kirana shop. As you can see, you can order things that you want to over here. Kaafi saari chinhe rakhi hoi hai pe. As you can see, let's keep moving. This is the groceries. And and then we have this supermarket at the top floor you can uh, get anything that you want i mostly come here for peanut butter and uh, other supplements let's go out this is the view from the top floor of this apartment as you can see it is amazing every evening i try to come here and just chill by this view and it looks very good especially in the night time i'll play some reel over here and you'll see what i'm talking about let's keep walking so this area this area has a ton of different things number one it has a movie pod so you can pay about 200 rupees and you can watch a movie with all of your friends whatever movie that you want to watch in a whole theater which is on the top floor itself and it also has a gym it also has place for you to play carrom for you to play any other game like foosball and any other games like that has a great view that you can see over here now in the last video that i made of my house tour i was not allowed to go to the top floor but apparently they built everything over here itself so let's keep walking and exploring this place we are at the wrong side so now we'll go to the right side where uh, we'll be having the gym and other facilities so let's go there and explore what all do we have interesting part about this place is that all of the towers are connected in just one single building right so we were in the c building that this is the b building now we are going towards the a building over there let's keep walking it's a good place to just have food and come out to walk look at the greenery and look at the whole skyline right so the best thing is that in the night time i come at about 11 or 12 o'clock and i just observe the whole bangalore skyline right i can see all the tall buildings i can see flights landing and it is just really soothing right let's keep walking to have a look at the other amenities theek hai so now we are entering the b building that you can see right here what all do we have we have this place where you can organize a party if you want to right so you can call in your guests you can get your caterer and you can serve food if you want to do that moving on we have this place to have some drinks what all do we have here this is the movie pod that you can see right here i think it's closed for now but you can pay like 200 300 bucks and you can watch a movie right here if you want to do that there's also a place for you to play carrom the place for you to sit if you want to this is called as a games room this is billiards as well billiards if you want to play that moving on let's see what else do we have there's a party hall as well if you want to organize some parties I think people are already there's already a party over here. Happy birthday party organized over here. Good space. Let's again keep walking. There's another movie pod that you can go and watch a movie in. Let's go. Okay, this place is locked apparently. So let's go outside and then go to the gym area. All right, we are now at the A building, which is where you will have the gym. So let me take you, let me show you what the gym looks like. I am not consistent with the gym because I have so many other things to take care of, like washing clothes, like hiring people, like getting IKEA furniture and other things. But anyways, I keep coming here once or twice every single week. I will be doubling down on that in some time. All right, so now we are entering the gym area. As you can see, it's much smaller than the last place that I was living in, but uh, it has good views at least, right? So this is a view of what the gym looks like. This is the gym area that we have. All right, now we are at the ground floor, which is the first floor apparently over here. There's a swimming pool over there. Lots of dogs, as you can see. There's a dog right there. In the evening, there are a lot of dogs coming around, so it's a good time to go for a walk and play with dogs. So the fun fact of getting a place in Bangalore is that 
you have to share everything about you and what you do which company you work at and then they might give you the opportunity to live in their apartments right so for example for me they were asking exactly aapki age kya hai kya kaam karte ho married ho single ho and so many questions right they would ask me for my linkedin profile as well then they would show it to the owner owner would say something they take a huge deposit like 6 months deposit and then they give you the apartment if you want to take it and when you take back the deposit they'll always cut some money for other random expenses here and there but anyways that's the hard reality of getting a place here in a city like bangalore the reason i still live in the city is because of the people that i get to meet every day so recently couple of days ago i got to meet ankur and ansh and some other people at i am bangalore i visited the amazing campus over there loved it also got to interact with a ton of people who are studying at i am bangalore itself so that was a great experience and that's why i chose to live in this city versus a cheaper city like pune or even indore for that matter keep walking let's head to get some food right so there's a mall over there we'll go to the mall we'll have some food there is also a lot of shops nearby that you can go to for dosa or some quick snacks over here so i'll show you all of that let's head along over there now we're outside of the apartment we are headed towards the mall and i'll also show you all the things that we have over there chalo so one of the best parts about moving out is that you get to live with people that you are building things with It was very hard for me to leave my parents. I have been living with them for the entirety of my 21 years of existence. But then I chose to come out of my comfort zone and come to a new place and learn to adapt and that's what we've been doing. So every morning I come here to the garden that I will be taking you to have a quick walk, do some chin-ups and pull-ups and that's what we do. Come I'll show you. So this is the area where I go for a walk as you can see. We have a nice pond over here. There's a lot of greenery. I come over here every single time to have a good walk after a long day of work. And uh, there are some companies like IBM. They have their offices over here that you can see. Uh, there's a hotel called the Leela right here. I don't know if you can see this or not. But yeah, that's what this place looks like. There's a place for kids to play over there as well. Let's go to that area. So this is the place where I go for a quick exercise, some stretching that you can see, and I keep walking over here. Let's go. Let's get some chin-ups done over here. So yeah, that's that's what I do every morning after a quick walk. We are here for some chin-ups. Let's go have some food now. Cheek hai. Now let's head over to the mall. There is a hotel here as well. As you can see. Ah, it's a good sun sunny day here in Bangalore. Doesn't rain often here. It's the good part. Let's go. Let's go from here only. In the evening we have love birds like them around this place. and then i feel lonely all the time time to find some person for myself what do i do bro any any all tips I work, all i do is work <laughs> how do i find my love bird see yeah, another couple right there hi karte hain kuch karna padega iske liye abhi road map batao puchne ke liye se road map iske liye kya karna hota hai so now we are at the mall that you can see over here kaafi sare brands hai starbucks yahi par hai to i call everyone for Tea or just to catch up in the Starbucks itself, but let's go have some food at the food court, which is the top floor. Ajo. So yeah, so now we are at the food court. There are tons of brands over here, mostly unhealthy food. But we are going to MTR to have a quick breakfast. We'll have some dosa as well as idli. So let's do that. You can also get pizzas. You can get uh, Kailash Parvat, North Indian food, and there's also a restaurant over here. But let's go have some food at MTR. So the story is that I'm eating food for one month here. Then I'm ordering through Zomato and all. It's taking a lot of money. but finally we got the gas connection in the house which means we can finally have meals in the house itself shall be hiring a help who will help me out with all the meals and all but today we are here for some quick breakfast so chalo let's have it i have no words my book is finally out i'm just looking at it again and again really excited for this if you're watching go buy it if you can 
and read and learn from it. So I am having my idli right now. Thank you so much for watching this video. This brings us to the end of the house tour. It was more of a house plus mall plus amenities tour. But I hope you liked it. Go check out my book if you have not already. Thank you so much for watching this video. I will finish this food and get to work. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, let me know below as well. Rent, guess kare batao in comments ke andar. And also tell me which area is this in Bangalore. Thanks a lot. I'll see you again.